All right, y'all. Man, if you have not seen the first episode of the Netflix series Dahmer, woo, man, that shit is crazy. Wow. I'm not going to get too much into it if you have not seen it. I'm not going to give away a lot, but it is one particular scene I have to fucking talk about. So, spoiler alert, if you have not seen it, please don't even listen to what I have to say. I don't want to mess it up for you. I don't want to mess the experience up for you because I'm telling you, you're going to get so much into it, you're going to damn near want to break some shit. My God. I know the history of Jeffrey Dahmer. Who doesn't? He's one of the most prolific serial, like, killers of all time. And he scared the shit out of me. He scared the living shit out of me watching that, y'all. I just want to get to this scene. Okay, it was one scene in the movie where he was at a bar, at a gay bar, and he lured a a gay black American man to his apartment, sweet talk him, you know, tricked him to come to his apartment, which was stupid for one thing because right off the bat you can tell how like he doesn't have all his marbles you can just by talking to the guy just by looking at him the way he stares at you that would have been a sign like no I'm not going with you dude but he ended up going okay I get when you can overpower someone and if you know you got a certain height and weight on a particular person and you you know you're kind of afraid but at the end, he did get away. But I'm talking about doing that whole entire experience, how he just sat there and let Jeffrey overpower him, scare him to the point where he's sweating, he's crying, he's shaking, he's sitting on the bed with fucking blood, he's the smell. Jeffrey having a knife to the, up to the man's throat, pointing a knife at him. Then there were times where he would set the knife down and he wouldn't even attempt to fight this man. He just sit there and let this man scare him half to death. That could not have been me. I'm going to take a few cuts. I don't, I'm going to take a few slashes. There's no way in hell I'm going to sit in a man's apartment that smells bad. It's so bad to the point where the neighbor was smelling it. And I'm not, like I said, I'm not going to get too much away. But that part pissed me off so much because I kept screaming at the TV. Dude, he put the knife down. You're sitting next to him. Fight this motherfucker. Jump on top of him. Strangle his ass. Hit him in the face. Do something. Punch him in. Do something to get up out of that situation. But he just sat there. And allowed this man to intimidate him and scare him half to death. But like I said, he I'm not gonna give uh, away a lot of it. It's things that happen. That at the end you'd be like, okay, okay. Everything is good now. But it wasn't. That was just the first damn episode. First episode, y'all. This man is creepy as fuck. Damn good actor. He play a lot of crazy ass characters out, but he's a damn good actor. And he had me believing he was Jeffrey Dahmer. 
Like, I didn't see the actor. I seen Dahmer. That's all I seen. And that's what you want. Netflix, y'all did y'all thing on here, y'all. For real. Y'all did y'all thing. Oh, man. Mm, mm, mm. I just can't get over the... It's... Oh, I just want to talk about the damn episode, but I'm not. But it's also a scene where the father, in a way, he finds out about his son. And you have to, oh my God, you felt so sorry for the man. If you can just sit there and watch without having no type of emotion run over you, something is going on. I'm talking that scene with his father. When it was getting explained to him on what his son did things he had in his apartment and it was heartbreaking it was absolutely heartbreaking oh man I'm looking forward to episode 2 I'm going to try not to fly through it as fast we're going to take our time watching it me and my girl whoo I definitely want to hear y'all comments about this. If you've seen, the, if you watch the whole series, don't say anything in the comments about it because I don't want to know. I want to know what happened. I do not want to know, y'all. We're just talking about now, episode one. Don't give away too much in the comments because I don't want a lot of uh, potential subscribers to, you know, read and be like, oh, this will happen, this will happen. No. Say, say a little bit. Just talk about the scenes I was talking about. You know, you can get that part away. I'm okay with that. But God damn. So as always, thank y'all for tuning in. And make sure y'all uh, hit that subscribe button. Click that bell for the notifications. Because you will be in, getting reviews for every single episode. It's just episode one, y'all. So as always, peace, love, and deuces.